Tesla stock looks unstoppable again, doing a powerful bullish reaction, completely rejecting the top sign it gave us two days ago. This is a true sign of strength and if everything goes according to the plan, it could trigger another short squeeze. It just has to break some key resistance levels first. In this video, we'll study Tesla's technical analysis and we'll work on a few scenarios in order to prepare you to whatever happens next. Welcome to the Finance Hydro channel, my name is Nathan, so let's start our study analyzing the one-hour chart. In the short term, what can I say about the one-hour chart? It is Tesla is in a crystal clear bull trend, it is a 45 angle degree, higher highs, higher lows, insanely bullish, trading above the 21 EMA and and the EMA is pointing upwards as well. And like all of that wasn't enough, we still see a purple trend line connecting the previous bottom levels on Tesla and this purple trend line could work as a support level for Tesla if it does, if it triggers a sharper pullback in the one hour chart over here. So yes, the trend is very bullish and right now at this moment, it is not going to be easy for Tesla to reverse this bullish sentiment. A few, a few days ago, Tesla did a top sign over here. It was trying to reverse the bullish sentiment in the short term indeed. However, Tesla failed in losing the EMA. It failed in triggering a crystal clear bearish pivot point, right? A lower high, lower low. So right now the trend is still clearly bullish and there is not a single top sign right now at this moment. Tesla in the daily chart, Tesla just rejected this top sign over here. Uh, two days ago, it did a dark cloud cover candlestick pattern and right now today, we totally rejected this possible top sign, meaning the trend is still clearly bullish. Now, what's the problem on Tesla? Well, the problem is that Tesla has yet to break its key resistance level. In my humble opinion, Tesla has a crystal clear resistance around the 180 over here. Uh, on January 27, we found a top level over here. On January 30, we found a top level over here. Right now, Tesla is trying to break this area, the 180 area, but uh, it is still a little bit too soon to tell. But right now, I can tell you guys, if Tesla breaks this resistance area, it is going to trigger a crystal clear short squeeze. Why? Because if we take a look at Tesla's options over here, uh, let, let's take a look, let's study Tesla's options. Right now, we see a very huge spike on open interest around 180. It is the second highest spike. There, there are a lot of calls at 180 expiring this Friday. So if Tesla breaks the 180, probably the bullish momentum will continue. And we see a huge spike around the 180, the 180 over here on the volume as well. So the volume is spiking. We see a huge spike on open interest. So if we see Tesla breaking the resistance at 180, I do believe we're gonna see another short squeeze. And well, since the trend is bullish, I believe it is going to try to retest the next technical resistance, which we're gonna talk about later. In the weekly chart, in the weekly chart, Tesla is trying to bounce over here. There is no clear bullish reversal with structure on Tesla yet, meaning so far Tesla is still doing it is still doing lower highs, lower lows, right? There is no clear higher highs, higher low on Tesla yet. If it does, well, it is going to trigger a bullish reversal structure in the weekly chart. And this is going to potentially take Tesla to much, much higher levels. Therefore, I'm gonna tell you guys if Tesla corrects, and so far there is no top sign, there is no bearish structure in the short or mid term yet, but if if Tesla triggers a top sign, triggers a reversal structure in the short term, in the one hour or daily chart, it is going to trigger a pullback. And if it does trigger a pullback, it could just be a possible bullish pivot point, a higher high, higher low in the weekly chart. So in my humble opinion, if Tesla corrects again, maybe Tesla could correct to the, to the 21 EMA again, right? That could easily happen. If it does, in my humble opinion, that would be just an opportunity to buy Tesla at a cheaper price level. Because Tesla is bullish in the short and mid term. In the weekly chart, we are bouncing, but we could see a possible bullish 
reverse so we structure on it if tesla reacts properly now the monthly chart in the monthly chart the situation gets way way more serious because right now it is Fe it is february 1st over here and tesla is on the verge of triggering this piercing line candlestick pattern which we already described in past videos so i i, I won't take too long on this but right now we are almost triggering a fantastic bullish reversal structure so we are almost doing that however if tesla does a pullback let's not panic over here because the trend is still bullish as long as we don't see a crystal clear bearish reversal structure i won't tell you guys that tesla is a sell i won't tell you guys that tesla is bearish because tesla is not it is just not it is still incredibly bullish now nathan what if Tesla actually breaks the 180 over here? What if Tesla actually breaks this resistance level? Then, then what? What's the next technical target on Tesla? Well, let's take a look at options again before talking about the charts over here. But first, join the top 5% family. We are the 5% of traders that can actually make money while beating this market. So join the top 5% public track record, by the way. So check my, my website, the link is in the description. Now, what's the next spike on options over here on Tesla? Well, it is 200. The $200 strike on calls, we see a very huge spike on open interest over here. And this is for, this is for options expiring this week, this Friday. If we take a look at options expiring on February 10 over here, we see again, another huge spike on open interest around $200. Now, if we take a look at the charts over here, if we take a look at the charts, the $200 area is the next technical resistance area over here because this key point, the $200 was a previous support level on October 24, a resistance level on November 15, 2022, another, resi another resistance again on December 1. So yes, $200 price-wise and options-wise is a very interesting key point and uh, if we break the 180 i believe tesla is going to run towards the next key point at 200 dollars in my humble opinion as a retail trader as a retail investor now if you are still watching this video and you are not my subscriber i invite you to subscribe because you like the content am i right i mean why would you still be here watching this random brazilian guy talking about tesla if you didn't like the content if you don't subscribe you're gonna miss my future videos so subscribe you are invited the door is open now i am quite optimistic on tesla it is about to reverse the sentiment in the monthly chart we are bouncing in the weekly chart there is not a single reversal or pullback sign on tesla yet but of course i will keep you guys updated on this channel maybe in the one hour chart tesla could could possibly trigger a double top chart pattern over here if we fail in breaking the resistance at 180 over here, right? This is a real possibility. But even if it does fail in breaking this, re this resistance and if it triggers this possible double top chart pattern, I see Tesla just correcting to the previous support levels. We have the 21 EMA over here waiting for us. So I'm gonna keep you guys updated in this channel every single day. Subscribe, join the top 5%. Thank you very much for your audience, my dear friends. Stay safe. See you guys tomorrow.